Hey guys, my name is Chetan Snorri and today we are going to install the Hyper ROM version 7 and as you can see I am using the Hyper ROM version 6 which is a little bit laggy here and there so we are just going to update the ROM and to be on the safer side I am just going to clean flash the ROM and now we are going to just power off our device and now we are going to go into the custom recovery and to do that we are just going to press volume up key, home key and power key at the same time and now we are going to let go of the power key and as you can see that the ROM is booting into the custom recovery. I'm gonna clean wipe the ROM, so I'm I'm gonna wipe the whole device, and we're just gonna wipe Dalvik cache, cache system data, and we're gonna swipe to wipe. And now we're gonna go and install, and we're gonna select the micro SD card because the ROM is in the micro SD card, and we're gonna select the Hyper ROM version 11, and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash and the ROM comes with the Aroma installer so it's gonna boot into that and now we're gonna go next we're gonna agree to that and next and next and I'm gonna install with full wipe next and I'm gonna select Samsung apps and services browser, calculator, music app my files, S planner, video player I'm just gonna deselect the video player and weather widget, Wi-Fi track, memo, edge settings, smart manager, SL and that's it next and I'm gonna select the exposed framework and next and I'm gonna select the YouTube app and I'm gonna stick with the 4 into 5 layout and I would like the S7 boot animation and the ROM is now installed and now we're just gonna select next and we're gonna reboot the device and this is the Galaxy S7 boot animation and now we're just gonna quickly set it up and this is the hyper rom version 7 and first of all let's get into the settings and as you can see the rom is, is changed quite a bit and let's get into about devices and as you can see that the android version is still 4.4.4 and shows the marshmallow easter egg and, so, and also as you can see that the kernel is this a long number and you also have the about device and the ROM version is 7.0 and I think that's it. Thanks for watching guys.